What's up everyone? On this episode, we're going to be talking about the Taper 2 Regionals. Regionals is typically the meet following district. If you qualified, congratulations, happy for you. Now let's move forward and let's see what we can do at Regionals. I'm going to detail 10 days up until Regionals. Hopefully this works for you. If it doesn't, just tailor it and alter it, whatever you need to do to work for you. Typically for me, it was always on Wednesday was the district meet, and then 10 days later was the Saturday regional meet. So I'm going to outline the taper to regionals 10 days in advance. Day nine, this will be the day after the district race, do an easy, easy short run to recover or take off completely. Eight days before regionals, easy short run seven days before regionals medium run at comfortable pace six days before regionals easy long run a couple miles shorter and slower than normal five days before regionals easy short run four days before regionals a light workout very very light keep it at tempo pace it should feel kind of easy but you should feel like you're getting work as well so, you know, 4 by 800, 8 by 400, 12 by 200, nothing typically longer than that, I would, I would suggest. You may do some mile repeats if you're an elite runner, but again, keep them at tempo pace. Three days before regionals, easy light run. Two days before regionals, off or light run. One day before regionals, regional eve. You typically want to do a course preview. You know, see the course, see what it's like, run with the team, a nice easy run, and then throw in some strides, maybe leading up to the finish to, you know, get a feel for the way the course is laid out or just whatever. But just make sure you do your strides after an easy run. Keeps your legs kind of sharp. And then, of course, regionals. 